So, I'm happy to report that I got a job today. Uh, it's not the best job I could get out here, but something is better than nothing. Uh, I will start off as a cashier at a gas station. So, there's that. Um, one difference about this gas station is uh, I have the opportunity to move up. I already talked to the manager, and he's like, you know, you seem like you have a great head on your shoulders. Like, thanks. Um, but he's like, you know, I'm looking for people who, who want to start a career. And do I really want to? Um, not so much at a gas station, but, you know, the, the opportunity is there. So, you know, if, if it turns out that I love it, great. I can, I can move on, move up, whatever. Um, the other difference is, at least compared to gas stations back home, well, there are two more. Um, they have a big rig tire shop, so the other opportunity is to go into that and change tires on semi-trucks. And then the third one is that they pay $16 an hour, not to change tires, but to be a cashier, which is double what they pay back home. So, uh, it, you know, this job's good for now, but when it comes to finding a different job, maybe, um, like we're waiting on the background check for another one, um, that one is obviously going to pay more. And another difference of uh, between New Hampshire and, uh, well, not necessarily New Hampshire, but really, as far as I'm concerned, the rest of the country and North Dakota, is the housing allowance. Because uh, gas station doesn't have housing allowance. They do have on-site housing, which sounds like a, a good time. Um, you know, just walk across the street to work. Uh, but... Uh, the steel mill, not mill, it's not a foundry, uh, but they, they sell steel out of their raw materials. Uh, they're offering, um, assuming I pass the background check and all that, which I will, but they're looking at, or I'm looking at, it's like 18 to $20 an hour uh, with overtime available, and the housing allowance would be $1,600 a month, which is a huge amount of money. Uh, at least for someone like me who used to make that every month just working and driving to work and you know that's all I brought home but this would be for uh, just just housing like here you go here's some money for housing um, so it, yeah it's I mean the money is here if anyone's looking to <laughs> make a little more money I mean rent is higher I'm paying uh, we'll round it to 750 a month for uh, a bedroom about an hour out of town, and that's not ideal, but it's half the price of a bedroom in town. So, you know, it's you take the good with the bad. Um, but, I mean, it's, it's nice here. They're good guys, and uh, I'm comfortable. So there's that. Uh, this is really just like an update to North Dakota because I haven't talked to you guys uh, since I got here. Since before I got here. I was in Toledo the last time I talked to you guys. Um, anyway, so yeah, there's all that. Uh, quite an update. I'm sure there's more I can talk about, but um, I'll figure that out and come back to you later.